All right, what's up, Virgo? Anku Jasenev, long life, prosperity, good health to you always. It is I, El Sofo, Social Frito Ra, coming to you with another reading. I already did a reading for Scorpio, so if you have placement in your natal chart of Scorpio, go check out the reading, leave a comment, subscribe, all right? So let's get it started with the Numinous Astro deck for Virgo. And also, your energy actually came out because Sixth House and the Hermit came up. So definitely go check out that video for Scorpio that I just uploaded today. <laughs> All right, one, two, three cards. We have Taurus, the bombshell, right? Uh, one of your Earth sign um, sisters, right? Sister signs. Fourth House, Cancerian energy. So around summertime, something to do with the home and growth and expansion. All right, so with the Taurus energy, this is you, right? Sitting in a very comfortable place within yourself, a divine feminine energy, just basking in self-love and really being, I feel, uh, attentive to yourself, Virgo. Fourth house energy, this is the roots, this is the home. Jupiter expanding, some of you could be thinking about like, you know, either moving, buying a bigger home, right or just focusing on the family um be aware jupiter tends to ex in like expand right or enlarge uh situations and things in our life you know depending on them being what would be considered negative or positive but just be mindful that something good could be possibly coming with the blessing from jupiter expanding something that has to do with your home life okay check your placements in your native charts to see if you have taurus in there all right, let's get one more. We have space for it. And ninth house energy, Sagittarius energy, seeking. Again, some of you are possibly quite po uh, ready to take some vacations or take some trips, right? That are gonna allow you to expand and learn more about yourself and what you feel rooted in. All right, there go. Two, two, two on the clock. Let's see, we have envy popping up there. So let's not worry about envy coming from other people or let, let's make sure we're not tapping into that energy of envy. You see, because again, I just shuffled it still at the bottom. All right, I am the same as everybody, but with different challenges. So remember that. So don't ever think that the challenges you're facing are something that's gonna be harder for you than someone else because everyone has a different level of tolerance for, how, for the challenges that they take up and decide to take up an experience in these uh, like reincarnation lifetimes. We have friendship, love that. So some of you definitely could be working on your friendships. I understand that a friend is in my life for a reason, right? So we know that people are here for a specific amount of time. And once those relationships start to vibrate differently, that's when the distance and the rift uh, will usually occur. It doesn't mean that there's anything wrong with that. It just means that at that point, right, neither parties uh, no longer need each other in their timelines to continue moving forward, if that makes sense, right? We have empathy. I like this one. Always remember to show empathy. I am open to seeing both sides of a situation. So also what Jupiter could be helping you with um, uh, Virgo could be expanding your view um, and expanding the way you you show empathy in friendships or relationships at home, right? And happiness. Look at the sign of the dolphins, the water signs right there. I am aware that being happy means that I am on the right path, exactly. So like if we stay present every single day, and if you practice staying present every single day, then you're able to say, okay, I can see the blessings that I have in my life that some other people may not have, right? And it's like being able to uh, like take a shower, being able to buy the food that's necessary for you to live a healthy um, life and give your body optimal levels, right? being able to have a clean home, right? Being able to have um, peace within your home. Those are all things to be grateful for every single day. And when you're present, you're able to see those things and you're able to go, I feel it, I feel gratitude. And that's a great thing to feel. 
All right, so let's get some taro. It's 5.01 on the clock, so we're gonna keep these under 10 minutes since we're not watching more than 10 minutes worth of content at the moment. All right, so the lover's card popping up here. This could be, you may also be having something changing in your connection with a Taurus or another earth sign or a Gemini because we have the lover's card coming up here and this lover's card says that you know there's some decision choice that you may need to make in a relationship with someone <clears throat> all right but the not the nine right here my phoenix rising it definitely says that you have pushed through you have perseverance with you you also need to make a decision but there's some internal conflict with this, right? Or external conflict with this five, right? Before you move and decide to make that move, you really know that it's, there's an important decision and choice you need to make, and it's coming up. Four of Cups. Some of you may be feeling a little bored, right? Or like you've been waiting for something to come your way and you have really pushed um, your way forward and you feel like you've overcome like several challenges to get you over to a point where you're really comfortable now and now we have the eight of coins coming out at the bottom which says you have put yourself in a position now where you can make choices um where you can make all the choices right but make the choices on how you're moving forward right like you're totally in control of your situation right now with this eight and the ace of swords of the, right after that tells me that you're tapped in so that you have clear clear um, insight your ability to really envision and see the things you want to manifest in your life oh and an ace of wands after that I'm telling you you're getting all this energy renewed to you and something successful and to celebrate is uh, very near so Virgo that was your message Remember, like, share, comment, subscribe. It is I, it is so far, so see afraid of raw. I'm Jocelyn Long life, prosperity, good health to you always. Bye.